Signal gobies, also known as crab-eyed gobies, are about as cute as fish can get. They bounce around the bottom on enlarged ventral and anal fins, scooping up mouthfuls of sediment, filtering it for food. They favor silty and sandy areas where they live in burrows, maintained by digging and fanning the soft sand. In Papua New Guinea, Ned and I spent one dive watching a mated pair take turns at burrow maintenance. Curiously, over the space of our 90-minute dive, they worked on three different burrows. They would stop from time to time to feed a bit, then one would nip the other as if to say, get back to work. Low tank pressure forced us to leave the busy pair, but I carefully marked the three square meter area and returned the next day to show the fish to friends, but could only find one fish. We searched the area for two more days, but there was still just one fish. Then on day three, the second fish reappeared, back to work as if nothing had happened. A little research uncovered a paper that provided an explanation. At maturity, signal gobies form monogamous pairs, and after a courtship that involves the excavation of a honeymoon suite, coupled with some pecks and nudges, the female deposits a cache of eggs inside and seals the male in for two to three days. There was our answer to the curious fate of the missing mate.